In the Manuela with Hume murder, the suspect took two gold bracelets. One of the two bracelets had three different types of gold stranding or material braided together. Manuela Withian had three gold necklaces stolen. Two of them had heart-shaped pendants attached. One of the victims had some silver dollars taken. It wasn't unusual for the East Era rapist to take old coins. He must have been a coin collector. But on this particular attack, he took two coins and they're old silver dollars etched in the back of the coin, three initials, first, middle, and last, and a, a date. And there was two of those, and that's gonna be very specific. You're not gonna find a lot of coins with uh, those initials and dates in the back. If somebody's seen them, it may help close this case. During the 23rd attack in the East Area Rape Series, the suspect took two gold cufflinks with the initials MR. Missing from that crime scene also was a men's gold wedding band that was inscribed for my angel, January 11th, 1970. None of these items have shown up. So those items that have value, some of those items that he stole were unique. And uh, the original investigators made a very thorough canvas of all the pawn shops, uh, the gold and, and silver sale shops, looking to see if any of these items ever showed up, and none of them have. This offender kept many of these items and he would have had them secret away somewhere where he could go and retrieve them and relive those activities uh, to, to continue to fantasize whatever his fantasy was. If he has died, th those items were still in his possession. So loved ones going through a safety deposit box or a lock the dresser door or uh, maybe even a safe or something underneath the house. They may run across a cache of driver's license and, and single earrings and photographs that may not seem on, on the face to be anything of, of significance, but those could be our offender's souvenirs that he stole from our victims. In the Ransacker series, we see losses that show us that the Visalia Ransacker stole trinkets, essentially souvenirs from the crime scenes, just as the East Area Rapists did later in the East Area Rape series. He stole almost identical things, blue chip stamps, costume jewelry. The suspect would often take uh, valuable coins. There's 28 known cases where the Visalia Ransacker would take piggy banks or small amounts of change uh, over more valuable items that were in the homes at the time. Finding those kinds of items if you're cleaning out an attic, that would be something we would very much be interested in.